one of the most exciting trials was actually the um, study um, in metastatic pancreas cancer. We all know pancreas cancer is very difficult to treat. Okay? Most patients do not survive one year. So in, in pancreas cancer, we are missing very new target agents. So this trial looked for patients who had a mutation in BRCA1 or BRCA2 germline. Only a few percentages of patients do have it, but that may be very important for outcome. We already know that they are more sensitive to platinum-based chemotherapies, but this study took for the first time a target agent and integrated into the treatment of these patients of metastatic disease. And what they did was very smart. They used chemotherapy first and then randomized to a PARP inhibitor because PARP inhibitors are very well known to be very effective when you have a BRCA1 or a BRCA2 mutations. And they use it as a maintenance. Now, this is smart for a lot of reasons because it's an easy treatment to give. It's a pill and the side effects are not a lot. So these patients will have not only a break from cytotoxic chemotherapy, but potentially a very powerful treatment. And it was randomized to placebo. And what was shown that the time to progression using um, these PARP inhibitors was twice as much, from 3.9 to 7.8 months which is amazing in metastatic pancreas cancer. And then you could go back to chemotherapy. So I think this is the first biomarker-driven clinical trial using information of the genetic makeup of the tumor and using a target agents to extend the potential efficacy profile of metastatic colon cancer in addition to chemotherapy.